Hey home bakers, here's a fun thing for you. With a pair of scissors and a little bit of creativity, you can turn a simple baguette into a beautiful looking epi. Let me show you how. Roll that thing tune. This beautiful baguette called an epi is made of exactly the same baguette though as in the video I made the other week. I know it's annoying to have to go to another video just to get a recipe, so I've linked it up in the description box here for you. After you rest your dough, divide it, pre-shape it, and shape it exactly like you did a baguette. Then put it on your couche and let it puff up. That part is the same, and this is where we take it up a notch. With a pair of scissors at a 45 degree-ish angle, we're gonna snip it at intervals all the way down the length of the dough. It's important to snip the scissors all the way, but not to snip the dough all the way. We're kind of leaving a connected part running across the length of the underside of the dough, if that makes any sense at all. Starting at one end, hold the end of the dough, snip it and turn it with your holding hand in alternate directions with every cut. Snip, turn, snip, turn, snip, turn, snip, turn, snip, turn, and there we have it. Doesn't that look lovely? Got that? Cool. Let's switch it up a bit. The next one somebody did in class one time and it completely blew my mind to pieces. Let's have a look. This time we're gonna snip it and turn the pieces all the same way. I know. Snip, turn, snip, turn, snip, turn, snip, turn. Is there another one? Snip, turn. Yes, there is. Look at that. That looks wonderful too. The first time I saw that, I thought, why did I not think of that? It looks wonderful. The last one we're going to do, we're going to do a double snip, a small one followed by a large one. Let's check it out. Snip, snip, turn, little snip, big snip, turn, little snip, big snip, turn, little snip, big snip, turn, all the way to the end. That's quite pleasing too, isn't it? Yeah. Isn't it lovely what we can do and how stunning we can make a shape with just a simple pair of scissors? That's four epis shaped in three different ways. Load them all into the oven, exactly the same as your baguettes. Bake for 15, 20 minutes on a stone with steam and cool them on a wire rack and check it out. Beautiful epi slash epis. I don't know what the plural is. Each Stunning in their own special way. Easily made magnificent with the use of a simple pair of scissors. Isn't that cool? If you haven't checked out that baguette recipe I was talking about earlier, I will leave a link in the box underneath to the video and the recipe as well. Thank you all so much for being here and thank you to the Bake With Jack patrons who help keep Bake With Jack alive. I'll see you again very soon. Bye bye. Mm -hmm.